Hello, hola and bonjour everybody. This is Doug. And Matthew. From Crowbro's Bodybuilding. MB3. We're about to start off a home shoulder workout. So I was just gonna go over real quick. When I warm up, I don't know why, but for shoulders, that's the one thing I always do like like way more than a normal warm up. Like I don't just do like a little light weight until I'm feeling that. It's like I like to get a big burn. Cause if not, I've had a couple times where I like my shoulders, it really feels like like something's gonna like strain or like tear or something. I know it sounds weird, but my shoulders are always popping. So anyway, we always start off with like kind of a press and like a side lateral and then a front raise and yeah, even a little bit of shrug <laughs> action in there just to get everything warmed up, so. Yep. Never forget about, usually we use even lighter weight than this, but like classic warming up these rotator cuff muscles. This way and this way. This is a little heavy for that. <laughs> All right, Matt, let's throw on the 11s, crank it up a notch. All right, I think that's a good idea. <laughs> you see, we decided up a notch and throw on the 44s. And you might be asking yourself why we decided to do this kind of uh, stance, I guess, for the overhead press. For one, we're going to do standing, but Doug's a little too tall with these plates for this ceiling. So that's out of the question. And then second, come on, Doug. And second, for seated, this is just a home bench. It doesn't go up perpendicular with the ground. So geez, all we're left with is sitting here and actually works pretty well for the core. You gotta make do. And yeah, just like you were saying, like you gotta stabilize it. So it actually makes it pretty difficult. You can't just like cheat and like lean back kind of like an incline press. Yeah, it makes this, what, 133 feel like it's 184. <laughs> all right, so now we're doing some side flies. Um, obviously it's like this is to get a wider like cap to the shoulder but also the way that we do it I don't really know what all is completely different I think we might have our arms a little bit more forward but we were just talking and saying like it really hits our traps when we do it like I kind of feel a burn not only in my uh, delts but also in the traps and like we we're just saying we didn't even do a whole lot of shrugs or anything because this seriously is like a pretty crazy burn which could be a good thing or it could be a bad thing, but either way, the shoulders aren't really lacking, so it's worked for us so far. Just a little drop set. Ooh, a little posing update. <laughs> All right, we're moving on to, if you remember from an earlier video, the Berniest front delt exercise. This is just an underhand grip here, real loose, see how his hand's even opening up. And just the bar, a nice light weight, and it really focuses on your front delt and even those uh, little rotator cuff muscles. And man, does it get tired. That's why it's called the Berniest Exercise. Woo! That was good. Like I said, check out our channel for the old video about it. It shows you how to do it and everything. All right, we're doing some rear delts now. Trying to get a mix of a little bit of everything seated and just kind of like a rear fly. We were just saying we don't really like this because I don't know, it's like, it feels like the range of motion at the bottom's a little bit limited, but from this angle, it looks pretty good, so. It looks good, but damn. <laughs> Actually, yeah. Wait. Oh my. That's right. Got my 11 pounders. Yeah. There it is. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. We just finished our little home shoulder workout. And hey, for using what we have, it was pretty good. Gotta yeah. just need the basics for shoulders. So. Basically, our motto at home is gotta make do with what you got. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and either work shoulders or arms because you need the, <laughs> the yeah. least amount of things for it. No, yeah. but hope you guys like this video. And speaking of that, you can go ahead and like the video. Throw down a comment and even subscribe. But remember guys, there's always more on the way. So stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs>